Greetings, my friends. Welcome back to Elden Ring. That's right. We are back. Okay, so what I did was to purchase this. It's a spirit calling bell, so we can finally use ashes. Because honestly, with this boss, we got to try out the ashes over here. I don't believe we'll be able to kill it otherwise because we need someone to distract him and we can't call can't summon an NPC here but we do have a bunch of those ashes here and hopefully these guys will be tanky because we need someone to be tanky not necessarily to do damage because we can do damage to him but they gotta be tanky so yeah we're just gonna try just, just gonna try these ones because they have shields probably these guys here are good as well this one or maybe this one we'll, we'll just try out there we go we summon them Maybe they're not very tanky. There we go. I mean, good progress though. But what we also need to do is to maybe get more stamina over here. Because see, now we can't summon them anymore because we don't have enough stamina. We need to have enough stamina to keep on summoning. can summon them only once so yeah we i need to i need to farm a little bit and put more points into stamina and then we can uh, try again okay back so what i did was to actually level up this the mind thing not the stamina uh over here this one put more points and also actually let's um Let's change this. Those guys weren't very good. So this guy. Maybe he's a little bit more tankier because uh, those skeletons with the shield died right away. So now maybe we should have leveled them up as well because you know even those ashes can be leveled up. But I'm not sure if the NPC that is leveling them up is still there. Okay, now it should be doable. Let's go for it. So we can summon the thing. Even this guy is not very tanky to be fair. Uh, aggro the bro look behind you I oh, mean look behind you what the fuck Wait, it's already dead hey no fucking way okay they're not tanky at all Okay, so this guy is not good. 
Where can we find a guy that's really, really tanky? That's what I want. Or are they not tanky because they're just not leveled up? That's the issue. I just want tanky dudes, you know, to be a tank, not necessarily to do damage. I don't care about it doing damage. Maybe the skeletons were actually the best because it was, what, five of them? I look behind you, yeah, look, they're not. They're not good, they die right away. I wonder if we can summon them again. We should be able to summon them. Now we can summon them only once? Oh. Please, again? Yet. Wait, that hit us? Fucking molly cat. Oh, dead. Okay, never mind. <laughs> Wait, maybe they have a cooldown. Who knows? Do they have a cooldown? I mean, why can't we summon them again? We can summon them only once? It's kind of strange if you want to ask me. We should be able to summon them multiple times, not just once per uh, boss fight. But hey, anyways, at least we're making good progress. You know how to be the first uh, phase of this guy. To actually get to Malikath. Spawn them right away. It's uh, five. Yeah, it's five of them. Unfortunate that he's instantly killing them. There we go. I think we we'll won't survive. Oh, see, we can. This one works. Net. You just need the boss to aggro the fucking... There we go. Be uh, no, no, no. Oh, he killed them already? Can we summon them? No. Fuck. What is this thing that is? Why why are we losing health like that? No, so with that we just send them back.
we send them back we can't actually spawn them again but those guys are the best though because it's five of them Try and go back to the round table, but I think the lady that upgrades those ashes is gone. Or maybe the blacksmith upgrades the ashes now. Look at how aggressive he is, it's insane. See, this is why we have to keep him in that area, because he just goes everywhere here. And we can't even reach him, okay, just... Look at what, we're not even hitting him. I killed all of them. Actually, there's only one left. He needs to stay there, because he's not going to jump off, obviously, right, so... We can't believe in this area. Okay, let's see if those can be upgraded. I want to put more... Uh, I want to be more tankier, in a way. And I'm not sure what else can be upgraded. Nah, those should be the best, to be fair. Maybe these guys as well. Or these ones. Take a look around. Don't worry. I'll continue spirit tuning just to say which is right. Oh, there we go. Spirit tuning. Oh, but we need fucking runes. Okay, that's fine though. Okay, what we're gonna do is uh, try a few more variants here, because the spirit runes, it's easy to get. Because we have those runes that we can use. Like these ones here. Like this stuff. And then we upgrade, you know, we upgrade the ashes. But I want to see which one will actually be the best. So maybe those guys are just better to upgrade. As most likely we're going to need those ashes for the final boss though. Because we're getting there, we're getting really close. Yeah, this is spawning one, two, three, four, five. Okay, spawning five of them. Why? What is this guy doing? Aggro? Nah. Okay, those are bad. Because they don't have those great shields. It's not, they're not very good. That's unfortunate. That they're not very good. Yeah, and this one is just... Okay, and we have... One left to... To try. 
for this one we definitely need someone to fire monk ashes no no actually it was this yeah it was this we definitely need someone to distract him because with that sword if that sword hits us so like is is the damage done by the sword and then is the damage over time thing like instant damage and then it takes we still lose health and we don't even have time to use the potion or maybe what if we equip more at the same time do you think we can spawn more No, they're already dead. Yeah, even these guys can't be spawned. The question is, can we spawn two different ones at the same time? So here, if we equip uh, these ones as well, so I want to I wanna spawn these ones and these ones. Will that work? Wait, was it this? No, not this, this, this guys. Okay, no, they can't spawn. Well, that's unfortunate. We need to bring him here. Found them again? No. Come on, dude, get your ass over here. Because I'm not going to chase you across this entire map. I'm sorry, it's just, it's not. No, no, okay, maybe it's not the best. Bro, we can fall? Oh my god, they can fucking fall, but they can't fall. They can't fall, but we can fall. It's just goddamn stupid that it can happen. Okay, let's go back, use some runes, and fully upgrade those guys. No, not here. Where are the rune sets? Hopefully, it should be enough. Spirit tuning. Okay, so. Plus one. Oh, we need this as well. That's it. Okay. Hopefully they'll be better now.
Okay, so the the second boss, I mean the second the second phase, we can't bring him near that edge because he uses that scream thing and he can push us over that over the edge. We don't want to die like that. Yeah, see, look, look at their, uh, look at their health now. Hey, can you get your ass over here? This is ridiculous. Get over here. I think we fucking lost all of them. There's no way we lost. Yeah, we lost all of them, bro. We, we lost. We actually lost all of them. Those guys' attacks are not even dodgeable. We lost all of them because the fucker decided to just stay over there. Hey, again. Yeah. I, I don't know. I don't know how this guy is beatable. Honestly, we might have to like use God mode for him. How do you activate God mode? It's just I, I, I don't think it's beatable to be fair. <laughs> or maybe we keep we save the soldiers. For that fight. Because I mean, I honestly don't see how... We can dodge those attacks. Well, like the, the quick thing in... I don't even know how to explain it. Like the sword attack. It launches like five sword attacks at the same time. Like a ninja. It's fucking such a pain in the ass, bro. This game is so bullshit, I swear. Having this fucking god mode to beat it is just lame. But, I mean, look at this. Just look at those attacks, honestly. Just look at this. I mean, I don't want to spend fucking 20 hours here trying to defeat this guy. If we can't kill them in the next five deaths... Fuck, just use god mode. Can't be bothered. I, I honestly can't be bothered with this. It's just retarded that they can cheat like this. That is armor, everything like means nothing. Like what was the what are those values here with the damage, negation, and all of this shit? If if you can instantly like one hit and that's it, you're dead. I mean I just wanna finish this game at this point, but I don't care with those bosses. And I see how it ends. And now he's not rushing anymore. Sometimes it rushes, sometimes it Now he's using fucking ranged attacks. They're too, they're way too quick. We, we just don't have the movement. We don't have... I don't know what we're missing. Honestly. <laughs> but it's actually insane. Okay, so... And we're already dying, look at this.
Look at those attacks, man. L look at those bosses. Like, how? How are we supposed to defeat this? Like, this guy swings his sword. Like, he's, he's huge. Look at this. There's no fucking way. There's no way, actually. We're dead. Nah, th this is not doable. Like, it's not, it's just impossible. Like, I don't know how you're supposed to do this. Like, what strategy are you supposed to use? Where are you supposed to go? Where are you actually supposed to go? We're just, we're just not going to finish the game. I'm just going to leave it here. Be like, fuck it. Might as well use the soldiers here. Nice. Good one. We're dead. Might as well use the soldiers now, you know? It's just, it doesn't make any sense. It doesn't make any sense. It's not normal. That you have to cheat to defeat a game. <laughs> to beat a game because, I mean, look at the look at the damage. Look at our damage and look at their damage. And the things that is not even about the damage. Like, look at the movement. How, are, how do you even move like that? How do you move that quick? How Like, what are you supposed to do? To jump on those pillars and, like, use those insanely, like, ranged attacks. It's crazy. It's actually it's and we can't even look look at our jump. Look at this guy's sword. Look, look at how, look at how he jumps. Look at how he can jump. And look at those, bro, like, nah, this is not normal, man. Like, how? Like, how is that a thing, honestly? We're dead again. How do you jump on those pillars like this and move? I mean, look at this guy's sword. <laughs> look at his sword. Like, we can't even roll that far away. We need, like, a, I don't know, a 20 meters long sword or a hammer, or whatever, to kill him. Now, if we can't defeat this guy, this is going to be the final episode, honestly. I'm going to battle with, like, trying to put God mode because they've created such a retarded ass game. Oh, 
awesome. I mean, look at how, like, coding, like, what coding is that? What coding is that? It just pushes you off the map like that. Like, how do you dodge that? How do you dodge it? Can't even get close to him. Yeah, they're all dead, see? Like... And we're dead again. Again, like, ju just like that. We're dead again. It's like we have a tiny bit of health. J just a tiny bit. It's like we haven't leveled up at all. Or at level 1. It's the very beginning of the game. We try to get, kill that guy on the horse. Look already, look at... Bro, like... It's not normal, bro. Where are you supposed to go? Look at the explosions, bro, that he's creating. Now we're not, see, we're not, like, we're not even hitting him. Look at how far away he is. Like, how do you get over there? Nah, that's it. If we die this time, I, I'm putting God mode on. Like, I'm not letting this bitch. Like, if he, if he has cheats, that's fine. That's fine. We're gonna cheat as well. Cheating it is. Yeah, look at this. Look at this. How is this guy not a cheat? If you're gonna create such a bitch ass game, bro. I, I don't know. Yeah, cheat it is. Nah, th this guy is not is not defeatable. It's not defeatable. Like we don't have the jumping parts, the whatever. We can't jump on walls. We can't be a fucking monkey or Spider Man or whatever to jump here, up here, then up there, then up here, then like in half a second to go from here to there to there to here in half a second. We just don't have that. 
Okay, ready to try this shit. I have God mode active. Let's fucking defeat this guy. Okay, let's go. There we go. dead Death is unbound. And the lands between are shrouded by death's dark fate. But the flames will also burn the impenetrable thorn. be Elden Lord yet. Right. Bro, what a cheat of a game, bro. To give fucking enemies cheats like this with the damage and with the jumping things and to make those bosses immense. Like... It's just nuts. I mean, you truly gotta be fucked in the head. I don't know why. What's the purpose of just doing that? There we go. Progress. Checkpoint. Finally. It's just at least make them fucking beatable, bro. Don't, don't put like flying shits and stuff that can jump 50 meters from here to here and just... I mean, honestly. Like, honestly, how the fuck? I mean, look at our jump. Uh, look at our jump. We're the fucking... We're handicapped in this game. And we're fighting gods. Fuck this.